Okay, let's take a look at a little bit of rock. Okay, a few things I want you to pay attention before we start is that you have ties, okay? Also here, ties. So you're going to play A, B and tie that eighth note B to the rest of the uh, rest of the line, okay? So you only play this B once. Also here, tie over, tie over. This will be six and a half beat, okay, for the B. One and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and, okay? That is not a tie, that's just a quick slur. That means you want to connect the A to F, okay? F, G, A. You will play all those notes, okay? But you will connect the A to F, then separate, and then F, G, A, connect, and then let go on the A. That's a staccato mark on A, okay? And then G is tied all the way, so you're going to hold seven beats for this G. G, two, three, four, five, six, seven, rest. Okay, here, slur, slur, not a tie, okay? And tie, once again, seven beats. Slur, slur, okay? So that's <clears throat> tie and slur. Now, two staccatos, okay? Left hand, you have these staccato marks on those quarter chords, quarter notes, okay? And shifting from G chord to F chord, okay? Here, notice you have a natural sign in front of F that cancels the key signature F, F sharp. Okay, for that entire measure. So F natural, F natural, F natural. Okay, that happens here again. Okay, here again, here again, here again. Okay, those are all F naturals. Right hand, you have an F natural here. So that cancels the F sharp. That's also F natural. Okay, so that natural sign rules for the entire measure. So actually, you don't have F sharp at all for this piece because of those natural signs, okay? So I'm gonna try to demonstrate this one. Oh, one more thing. This dim, short for diminuendo, okay? That means start strongly and gradually get softer. And we wanna end on piano.